Good morning! Today we're checking in with Hall on Japan's Hosho Marine, gracing the latest cover of the Comptic Magazine, now set to have her Nindoroids sent out and shipped out, and with orders of her latest Good Smile figurine set to close in a matter of hours. We turn now back to her latest hit music video, I'm Your Treasure Box, an animated video so risque that parts of it had to be censored with uncensored screenshots sent to those subbed with her member the video has been incredibly popular now with eight and a half million views. Let's go ahead and take a listen. <laughs> This leading us now to Osakaki saying, Marines, I'm Your Treasure Box has been featured on USEN cable radio in Japan recently, which apparently a lot of shops and workplaces use for in-store broadcast. And I've been checking out some of the recent comments on the YouTube video, some amusing ones I decided to translate for fun. Sencho's moaning was broadcast in broad daylight at full volume in a shopping district my grandpa and grandma walk around in. This was playing at my tennis school, of all places. At my job when we play cable radio over the speakers and this song comes on the customers who haven't heard it start looking at the speakers all surprised like when i went to train at the gym this song was playing my pecs were pleased by sincho's lewd voice this was playing at my job and i'm relieved to come here and find many of my kind this was playing in the actual supermarket and i panicked hard thinking i was the one playing it with my earphones disconnected great song and voice but i'll never forget the feeling when i I was driving with my family with my phone plugged in and this came up on autoplay this was playing over the radio at my job and kids come in here so i spent the whole day worrying should i stop this or not is it too lewd this was playing in the dentist waiting room today in a room full of families with kids since shows moaning filled the air from joy and embarrassment i couldn't hold back my laugh so all i could do was put my head down cover my mouth with my hand and pretend my tooth hurt congrats i had a good year of my wisdom tooth. Next up, we have some very good news that regarding the Marvel and Star Wars geek of production kawaii, Ocean Otoishi, who yesterday we reported had her YouTube channel terminated, cited by YouTube as having multiple violations of spam or deceptive practices. Ocean would say, look who's back. Thank you so much, YouTube, for addressing this issue in a timely manner. I got it back in less than 24 hours. Thank you also to all of my Oshi Shell beautiful beating hearts that keep me going, believing in me. Adding, I can't lie, what happened was scary and quite traumatizing. I was running high on adrenaline and felt nothing but alerted. Now that everything is much calmer, I can finally shut my eyes and rest. And along with that voice tweet, we also have this artwork stating, I lived Oshi Shell by way of Yuto Gichi, stating her channel was off all night, but I think Ocean is okay. Welcome back. And speaking of production kawaii, here we have everyone's angel Nene Amano posting up this screenshot and saying, wake up, babe. Production kawaii, Gen 1 official idol outfits are all revealed. This as a part of their successful Kickstarter project and with more definitive dates to come. However, this talent is also having problems with YouTube, taking to Twitter to have it resolved as is so common these days. Saying, hi team YouTube, I've been waiting since August 29th to get this 25 second video looked at. When can I expect to get it reviewed? Usually my videos get a response within three days. Thank you for your time. Adding the video was pre-flagged as not suitable for most advertisers the instant it was uploaded and was sent to YouTube for review. YouTube would then ask to have the video set from private to unlisted, as apparently even they can't watch privated videos. With Nene later following up, are there any updates to my video? It's been seven days and there is no review for ad suitability yet. With even YouTube saying, that's odd. If there's still no update at this point, we recommend reaching out to our creator support for a closer look. And now for a closer look of Mika Melatika with Niji Sanji saying, thank you for 250,000. That's right, a quarter of a million YouTube subscribers for this talent. Saying further, all your support means the world to me and I could never ask for a better community. Yes, I meme a lot, but the length I needed to go to dodge copyright is at least something right. And this is new. Here we have a tweet advertising a fall asleep fast in under five minutes video and using Mika's art tag with Mika directly responding, there is no way they use my art tag for this. I'm taking this one personally for real. And very quickly with Niji Sanji English, we have Petra Gurren stating, I shouldn't be falling for this. I am in Niji Sanji. That coming from Foxtrot, posting up this video and saying the teaser for the new Lux song was accidentally uploaded for a second, but it's absolute fire. Let's go ahead and take a listen. <laughs> Yeah. 
if you know, you know. And certainly someone in the comments down below can help elaborate on what that song means. Turning us now to Luxian member Niji Sanji English's Ike Evelyn, stating this meme just keeps on giving and admitting also I am ashamed to say that I got really scared for a second before I realized, wait, we haven't even recorded a song since Jazz on the Clock. Further tweeting, I'm going to be honest, I don't listen to our songs post-release, so I barely remember what they sound like. So if you told me this was one of our songs, I'd probably believe it. Now turning us to Niji Sanji English's Pomo Rain Puff, getting this victory royale and confirming, never mind, Fortnite owns, while posting this video and saying this song has the best rhythm. Hey, baby girl. I found this really sexy song to uh, set the mood with. Tell me what you think. Immediately after saying, I'm sorry. Next, we have an update from Hall Live Production, who is now celebrating five years alongside their very first talent, Tokino Sora, having debuted on September 7th, 2017. Saying as a celebration, the official archive program, Tokino Journey, will be released on YouTube. Hollow Myth member, Nina My Eninus, Hollow Council member, Hecos Bells, and Tempest member, Axel Sirios, make a special guest appearance. Sora also confirmed that she is holding a 3D celebration concert, including guests Rubico, Miko, Aski, and Suise. All right, and we also have a brand new website, complete with a year-by-year -year breakdown, including debuts, but not graduations. We also have this very popular tweet, now clocking in at 178,000 retweets, in which if a user does retweet this on Twitter, they'll be assigned a Hall Live member they are most compatible with. This has been so popular that actual results are now taking hours to send out, and Hall Live sending out this notice followers who have notifications turned on are currently receiving a large number of auto reply notifications if you are concerned about this we apologize for the inconvenience but we would appreciate if you could turn off individual notifications only during this period also celebrating five years is a chan part of the hall live staff who joined alongside tokino sora apologizing for all of the notifications wishing a happy anniversary to her good friend sora and herself and saying it's been a long road it's been hard work but it's been fun. I'm glad we kept going. I recently had a conversation with Sora about this. I'm sure it will be published somewhere soon. We also have quick updates regarding Iris. All Live English's V singer saying going on a summer workation with Watame Senpai. So I'm so excited I can't sleep. That being Sunamake Watame of Hall Live Japan saying she also could not sleep. Hollow Council's Nanashi Mume took to stream and packing heat. Showing off this asset and saying thank you to Kudoran. Reflecting here in this work from Sonoka, all while today had a very special stream from Takanashi Kiara, a Hall Live English member showing off the brand new update for Hollow Cure, receiving an early access version, and Hall Live EN memes was there, saying Fabuki skills look like she is about that dodge and speed buff, Mio looks like she's a brawler, Okayu is Majin Buu, Korone is definitely a tank, Miko is focused on healing and gaining buffs, Suise is a crit based DPS character, Robico's electric ring seems really strong and levels up faster than any other character. ASCII very much encourages dodge or AOE focus build to maintain buffs and Sora turns healing to damage. And next up with Hall Live Indonesia we have Pavolia Rainey letting us know that on September 9th we have the Pavolia Rainey birthday 3D poly live event. Clarifying just to be clear in case anyone is still confused after the logo not official 3D but offering up this a layer in which fans can put over their avatar to show off their support. Further along with Hall Live Indonesia, we have Muna Hoshinova tweeting, Can't wait to meet you guys. That being at the Indonesia Comic Con, located at the Jakarta Convention Center on October 1st and 2nd, with not only Muna, but Kobo Kanaru, who lately has been seen alongside Tempest's Regis Altair, and delivering to him mental damage, collaged here by Keen Biscuit, with one another denying each other praise, leading to Craven Wintermelon to say, I can't get enough of these two. And now the tables have been turned, with Ragu asking, who's the short one now? And Altair quote retweeting, my worst nightmare. And from nightmares to dreams, here we have Tempest's Noir Vesper here on a Zoom call as the Grandpire is very much trying to figure out new technology with very mixed results. And at 2 a.m. in the morning, asking if you could gain control over my Amazon account and buy any item on the site to be sent to my door, what would you buy? Could be useful, could be a troll item, anything. Throw Amazon links in the replies below. Hello, 
below, confirming it's for a future stream. And yes, I had my very own suggestion, recommending this very comfy t-shirt, while others had more adventurous suggestions, including men's lingerie. This item listed as sexy get naked women flirty cartoon girls silhouette shower curtain lady sexy body decor polyester fabric waterproof shower curtain the creeper deluxe minecraft costume and yes the original boyfriend body pillow and now for more vtuber news we turn to our co-host heidi thanks smalls and kohayo everyone first up we have nijisanji ian selen tatsuki who has uploaded her background music blackout anthem an arrangement of obsidia's debut song blackout that played during her outfit reveal and also reacting to herself appearing on a trading card that of which are made by wig sauce in collaboration with the members of niji sanji and will go on sale in december of this year one of the featured talents being fellow obsidian member rosamie lovelock seen here in this art of her lovely new outfit and replying to the wig sauce trading card saying i'm in blushy face takanashi kiara giving lots of support replying that's so cool i love wig sauce congrats rosamie lovelock also shares with us much thanks for her reaching 400k subscribers on youtube as well as another niji sanji talent maria marionette celebrating 300k followers on twitter and 300k subscribers on youtube giving her thanks to us and her senpai pomu rainpuff who helped maria against creeper as well as her sir ventrilo mansion build shown here in minecraft replying here we have another niji sanji senpai luka kaneshiro giving maria more congratulations and an interesting aussie interaction and as we check out anime impulse an anime and cosplay convention that held the Showtime with Luxium meet and greet event. Luca shares his thanks, saying, Thank you everyone for coming to our event. Enjoyed talking to all of you. We're always so thankful for your support. Fellow Luxium member Mr. Rias sharing this photo of the crowd that attended the Anime Impulse event and saying, Thank you everyone. You made one of the most memorable nights of my life. Even to those who couldn't come, it really means a lot to me and all the boys when you support us in any way. A lot of people came by to say to me I helped them through tough times, but it goes both ways, trust me. But the photos don't stop with Mista, or should I say photos, as he shares this image that reads, nice to feet you, saying, I got hacked and this image got leaked. I'm sorry, I was on a date. And sharing with us the free to use feet holding asset featured here, created by Claudia Matsumoto. Next, we have Aluna member Kyo Kaneko, announcing his collaboration stream with 39 da where they will be playing Unrailed, stating that his first flesh tuber collab complete and wishing Daff a happy birthday as well. Moving on to the Japanese branch of Niji Sanji, we have Salome, with fans reacting to her apartment background, commenting how the room is a normal apartment with a really fancy bed, and pointing out how she had originally started with a normal bed and laptop. User Fools Ivy replying, her goal is to make her room fancier as she grows and becomes an actual Odosama. Lastly, we have V Shoujo talent Silver Veil, with her mom, Mama Veil, both seen here as these plushies Silver Veil received from Nico Dark 20. She continues showing her excitement for both their appearance at the PAX West meet and greet event, concluding with a thank you to those who attended the event, saying thank you so much everyone that came to say hi. I love you. And that's all from me. Back to you, False. Thank you, Heidi. And for Indie VTuber News, we are back with our co-host, Lady. Thanks, False. Cloud9's Cosmic Dragon Girl Vienna is shown basking in the moonlight. This illustration coming way of Neon Beat while also announcing that a 3D Vienna is excited to meet you, thanking the hard work of her wonderful parent, Ginomu, following that you'll be at her debut, right? Though that's not the only debut Vienna would promote, as she shares her bittersweet love for her beautiful lemonade whale sister, Bao, Jiggly Whale Girl, showcasing a new lemon bow, with illustration coming by Hai Mai Fair and live 2D rigging by Iron Vertex's Brian Sui, to which some would be distracted by her thick and scrumptious looking tail just wanting to take a big bite. Others, such as Half Demon Half Swag VTuber Numi, would gladly bask in the wholesomeness that is Bao Sunshine. Only to then be called out by Swag Onicha and saying that we only know you watch to see Bao's feet, to which Numi unfortunately does not deny. Though Bao's new lemon form would not just be a random new addition to her look, as storyboards and illustration for Bao's lore video was done by Sleepy Bunsu, sharing some of the panels that were drawn, but also including mutuals such as Juniper, Virtual Mothwoman, and Monster Girl, shown here with Numi doing some wonderful summer activities. Though that's not all, as Sleepy Bunsu would reveal the Sid Trussy that birthed Bao. The Sid Trussy is becoming a new fan favorite, receiving this fan art from Greedy Dice. A new original song would also be released called Citrus Love, which is a song about the bittersweet feelings that come with the end of summer. Alongside her Citrus Love
Love merch collection with all albums now personally signed by Bao herself, reminding you not to forget to pre-order now. Her debut would receive some fan work such as this Lemon Grab Lemon Bao, but also receiving a congratulations from Aurelia Graphics, giving her weekly a new outfit. Illustrator and Twitch partner Sarue reveals her new swimsuit, which was drawn and rigged by WFN Art, but with the costume design and concept created by Sarue herself. As Sarue is shown here, bathing in the sunlight, this illustration coming from Rei Su Des, but also a new streaming screen for the new sexy outfit coming way of Bosan. Buff Pup, cringe wear dog VTuber, is currently in the midst of moving. But while she is gone, she has recently hit 100,000 followers on Twitch, exclaiming that she will celebrate when they get back and thanks everyone very much. Receiving this illustration congratulating Buff, commissioned from Tanami by Winry. And now back to you, False. Thank you, lady. And that is all for this episode. As always, feel free to like, comment, and subscribe below. Send your VTuber news to our Discord. We record live on Twitch and we'll have more. Things VTubers say for you soon.